Maitreya recently gave his first interview in America. The first of many such interviews. He <coughs> followed in Japan and Europe and so on. The master of all the masters. For the first time in human history, himself physically came on a well known television program in a major. Um, network in the United States, but undeclared as Maitreya, just as one of us. And he gave that interview, it would be watched probably by many millions, probably, I don't know, 10, 12, 13, 14 millions, who, who watch American television. And furthermore, on the internet. And that's the first time such an event has ever happened. Can you imagine what it means? For the first time in human history, the world teacher not only can come himself, but can speak to the world through the linked television channels of the world and address all humanity. His name is Maitreya, but he will not use that name until enough people are responding to him and what is called the Day of Declaration is, has arrived. Then Maitreya will come before the world on the Day of Declaration and acknowledge his true status. By this time he will become very well known and, and obvious as being somebody speaking along certain lines, telling humanity what he believes is necessary to, to change life for the better and save the planet and to save starving millions from ignominious death and so embark on the creation of a new civilization. Maitreya is about peace. He says, you know, it's so easy. You could make a world simply wonderful harmonized world if you like it is so easy all you need to do is to make peace and he says the most important thing in the world is peace because if we have no peace we have war and if we have war we could have major war that would be the end of life on planet earth how do we do it he says you have to create justice in the world Justice. He said, without justice, there will never be peace. So we have to redress the anomalies in the world. One little section of the world, the G8 nations of the world, usurp and greedily waste most of the resources of the world. Half the world are living in poverty. <coughs> Millions of them are dying of starvation, even as I speak. For want of the food which is rotting away in the storehouses of the developed world. That's the fact of it. We can only afford one world. That world has to be one in fact and in deed and at peace. And the only way to get peace is to create justice. He so said, the only way to get justice is to have trust. How do you get trust? There will never be justice if there's no trust. So the only way to create trust 
is to share the resources of the world. This is the year of the tiger. And the year of the tiger, according to Maitreya, is a year in which great things take place. Great big things take place. The tiger brings about <coughs> big change. And humanity will wake up in this year and from now on and will demand of its governments changes which up till now it thought it would never get and the world will undergo quickly a change set in motion in this coming year by humanity itself. <laughs>